and that's because I got my GCSE result and I am enrolled in the sixth form that I want that I want to get into. I was applying this weekend, so it's magic supply, so welcome. Here's a picture. Oh here's a picture. I don't know how it's being recorded. Here's a picture of me at Magic Supply. It was a lot of fun. It was my first uh, year of going to a going to fire play, so I was well happy. I'm gonna tell you what I got in my P Middle. Change the eight star to G system, so now it's a nine to one system. It's really confusing. This is how it works. So the fire is like a C it's a strong path. Four is also a C but it's not a good path. It's still a path though. Nine is like the highest that's above an A star, seven is A and six is B and so on. You can get it. Just in English language I got seven, which I'm really really pleased with. So I actually started in year ten as a three in English language and so the fact that I can go from a three to a seven I'm so proud, right, I'm so happy with that. It, but in English literature I got a five, which I'm still very happy with, but I just feel like I come from a bit better. In math, I got a six, which is a B, which I'm very happy with. In combined science, which is two GCSEs, I got an eight and a seven, which I'm really happy with, because that's like A, A star, etc. In history, I got a seven, which I'm really happy with. I worked out. That was my favourite subject. I worked really, really hard in that. I'm so happy with that. In geography, I don't know how I got this, but I got a seven, which I'm happy with because I hate geography. I was awful at it. I never ever thought I'd be able to get a seven in geography. Like, you saw how awful I was at geography in that geography video. You know what, diagram I hate the Gershmel. What's the Gershmel? Gershmel, it's the thingy diagram, it's the one with the three circles. What's chalk made up of? Dagaman. Oh. <laughs> First page! <laughs> Name me two igneous rocks. Granite and basalt. You've just read that, haven't you? <laughs> you could give me a definition of what an oxbow. Right, I, I'm going to demonstrate. So we start off. That looks more like a snake. <laughs> What the hell is that? Oh, you should have taken art. Oh, oh that reminds me of the weekend. <laughs> right. Well, what causes the meander? You can't remember. <laughs> yeah, over time, yeah. Over time. We go like that. Oh, it's gone straight. And then. Oh, that reminds me of the weekend again. Oh, well, then. Fun geography is so interesting. No, it's not. In Spanish, I got a five. Well, that's because I did the foundation paper of all my exams. You have to do full exams, listening, reading, writing, speaking, and did foundation and all of them. So that's, that's the highest that I've ever got. And in Creative Eye Media, which is one of the only corporate based subjects left, I got a level 2 merit, which is a B. But I'm a little bit annoyed because I've only one mark of a level 2 distinction, which is no, which is like an A. I feel like um, if I had more time on like some of the unit, I could have got more marks out of them. But because I had, because they all mounted up towards the end, on the final unit I had all my other GCSE exams as well. I could have, if I didn't have them as well, I feel like I could have done better. So, yeah. But I am super happy. I'm so pumped by that. I'm so full of energy, so full of life. I just feel great, just awesome. And yeah, I want you guys to comment below how you did uh, on your GCSE result. Any results were uh, amazing. If you just go into the exam itself, that's amazing. Because the exam room itself, it's like an exam. Going into an exam room is an exam in itself. And you've got You've got everyone there, you've got so much pressure, you feel like everyone's, everyone's watching you, you just feel like you're doing something wrong, you've got people walking around. So, if you are confident to walk into the exam room and think, I'm going to do this exam, I'm going to do well, that's still amazing. It doesn't matter what grade you get, that doesn't change who you are as a person. So that is awesome, that is awesome me today. Um, I will try to get another video up soon. Miss Lloyd, hopefully, will be returning to the video very, very soon. But anyway, that's all for today from me, so I hope you have a great day, and comment your example.
because I can't wait to read them. I will write it, I will, I will park it, and so you don't forget to view. Bye!